In Google Sheets, you can now record macros just like in Excel. So we are going to go up to Tools, Macro Submenu, and right there, click Record Macro. As you can see, it states it there, recording a new macro. I'm going to do something simple. I'm going to go ahead and bold this first column. And then I'm going to alphabetize by last name. All right. And then I'm going to hit Save. You get to name your macro. I think of something very creative, example macro. And if you want to set a keyboard shortcut, it also lets you do that. And now we're going to hit Save. So if you wanted to look at the inside of your macro, I'm going to real quick show you. You can hit Edit Script, and there it is. If you're interested in the code of actual macros and making your own, you should check out my other videos. I am now going to test this out. So let me paste a new date here. Uh, let's put in a new name, Mark Apple. Perfect. Eighth grade, set a color group. Great. And I'm going to unbold that to make sure it demonstrates our macro is working. And let's go back to tools, macros, and you can see right there, that's my macro, example macro. We have to authorize it, so I'm going to go ahead and click on continue. And now I have to use my account. Yes, I want to allow this macro to run. Running script, and it's finished. Our column is now bold. It is now alphabetized by last name again. Please hit subscribe and like if you found this video helpful.